My name is Esther Osanya, wife to Anthony Kerr, yeah. who is being jailed in South Sudan for life imprisonment. Yeah. Okay, what we, what we understand is that the, the, the company involved in a fraud of a uh, known amount of money. What I know is just that the company itself involved in a fraud of uh, more than a billion of, compared to Kenya shillings. Yeah. He had gone to, to look for green, greener pastures since he was working here in Kenya and uh, he was linked up by a friend who was working in Juba, so he went there. The last time he saw his son, he was uh, 10 months. Right now my son is 2 years, 9 months. And also he meant a lot to the family, like the mom, he's a critical, he has, she has arthritis and uh, it's so bad he was depend she was de depending on my husband for medical bills and everything. The whole family, the rest of the family also. Financially I can't say that I'm stable since, okay, I got a job but it's not that well paying. But I'm really struggling. It's not that easy. Okay, so far we've really tried. We've tried a lot. We've held demonstrations since last year, but uh, we've not gotten anything from the government of Kenya. They always just say that, okay, they're making up, they're trying, but we've not seen anything upcoming. So far, so good. we've not gotten anything, any assistance. We've gone to the office of the president many times. Minister of Foreign Affairs, but we've not gotten anything concrete. Even the government itself know, knows that these Kenyans are very innocent. They don't have anything to do with the case. But, okay, we are not even sympathizing. We just want them back home. Yeah, if they really care about their citizen, let them bring them back. Okay, first of all, I mean, Mohammed has really let us down. Yeah, many times. I think he has, uh, if she has that motherly love, she could have, even she could not have thought twice. But now she has let us down. And uh, for the president, please, please, if you have a son, I know you have two, just put yourself in our shoe and bring our boys home. Yeah, that is my appeal.